Hey, everybody out there. This is your Market Minute update. All right, let's get into it. Fall has ushered in cooler temperatures, but hotter inflation, which has had an impact on households all over the country and confidence among small business owners. The impact is obviously trickling down to our real estate market. While we are seeing pricing still on the rise, the pricing is slowing. Statistics do not lie. As buyers are waiting for a cool down or crash, it has not happened yet. There are a whopping 32 homes in foreclosure in our MLS as of today. There were 3,897 closed sales in October. There are a little over 5,100 homes for sale in our current market. These numbers include not only single family homes, but condos and townhomes as well. And of the 5,100 homes on the market, 4,300 of these properties are listed as pending sales. There is a 1.3 month supply of housing. In a healthy market, there's usually eight to 10 month supply people. The average day on market is 10 days. The lowest market average was in May at six days. The average price per square foot right now is 212 bucks. That's right now. So I bet now you're wondering, what does this mean for you? Well, let's break it down. If you're thinking about selling your home, now is still a great time. Sellers are cashing out, they're upgrading, they're downsizing, they're moving across country. Remote work for millions of Americans makes this possible. For buyers, I know inflation and price increasing makes buying a home sound scary, but I mean there's a big giant but. The interest rates are still right around 3%. Homes have never before been this affordable. For example, four years ago, you could buy a nice single family home in Las Vegas for about $275,000. Your payment and interest would be around $1,400. But because interest rates were higher then, now that same house may be selling for $400. But because the interest rates are lower, your payment is still around $1,600. This has been your Market Minute Update with Rachel Black Johnson, Century 21 Gabish. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. I'm happy to help. Thank you.